This video presentation will demonstrate the main operational modes of MAP Online Pro, Meyer Sound's acoustical prediction program, and provide guidance on the user interface. MAP has four operation modes in the sound field window, Zoom, Rotate, Architecture Tool, and Select. The modes can also be changed from the Tools menu. A single click on an item in the sound field will select it. Clicking in the sound field will deselect all selected items. By right-clicking in the sound field, deselect can be chosen from the pop-up menu. Deselect is also an option in the edit menu. Dragging a box around a number of items will select any items the box intersects or surrounds. Holding the Shift key down while clicking allows for multiple item selection. To edit the parameters of an item, it must first be selected. To rotate an item, it must first be selected. If an item cannot be selected, it is likely on a locked layer. To zoom into an area of the sound field, switch to zoom mode and either click hold and drag a box to define the zoom area, or click in the sound field to zoom into an area. Command or Control minus zooms out. Command or Control plus zooms in, and Command or Control zero zooms to extents. To rotate items manually, select one or more items, switch to rotate mode, and click drag on the center lines. Clicking will move the center of rotation to a new point. Switching back to select mode, then to rotate mode, we'll move the center of rotation back to the array. To rotate a microphone around a loudspeaker and find the 6 dB down point of the horn, insert a microphone on axis of the loudspeaker and note the high frequency level in the virtual SIM window. Select the microphone, switch to rotate mode, move the center of rotation to the loudspeaker, and drag the microphone until 6 dB of high frequency attenuation is measured in the virtual SIM window. The architecture tool is used to create visual aids by clicking and dragging a line. In this case, we can use one to represent the minus 6 dB point of the horn. The microphone is no longer needed. By selecting it and using Command E or the Delete key on a PC, we can remove the microphone. The loudspeaker and the visual aid can be rotated together by selecting both of them, switching to rotate mode, moving the center of rotation to the loudspeaker, and clicking and dragging on the center line. Visual aids can be used to represent lecterns, to mark speaker locations, notate rigging positions, represent seating planes, or anything else that needs to be represented in the sound field. Visual aids have no acoustic properties. Thank you for learning more about MAP Online Pro.